Hey, welcome to another episode of Let's Do This. Today we're going to be optimizing the breakfast process. In other words, we're going to be cracking an egg with one hand. So let's see what it looks like. All right, so here we have an egg. We take the wider end and we'll smack it alongside this glass bowl, by which I mean a gentle yet firm tap. And we'll take that crack and split the egg from there using our pointer and thumb fingers. And voila, we have a cracked egg with one hand. Now we want an easy way to practice this without going through a dozen eggs and getting yolk all over our hands. And the solution is to use an Easter egg. Specifically, this is the type of Easter egg that splits completely in half and doesn't have the hinge. One interesting thing that we'll notice is that the widest part is also where the seam is. And that's also where we're going to be aiming to crack the egg in half. In terms of the actual placement of the fingers, we'll have our middle finger right underneath the seam, our pointer above the seam, and our thumb across from our pointer finger. The motion is fairly simple. It's a matter of pushing the pointer and thumb fingers together and then pulling straight up. And of course, practice makes perfect. And once we're comfortable with that, let's go back to the glass bowl and let's get our egg. From here, it's exactly the same as what we just practiced. We can imagine where the seam is with the wider end towards the top and the smaller end pointing down. The finger placement is exactly the same. We have the middle finger underneath the seam, the pointer above, and the thumb across from that. And it will give the egg a nice crack. And this is probably the most important part. We want to make sure that the crack is deep enough so that it's easy to pull the egg apart. And from here, with the pointer and the thumb, we squeeze in just a little bit and then pull up. And voila, here we have a cracked egg with one hand. And that concludes this episode of Let's Do This. Subscribe above for more ridiculous, fun, and sometimes useful things. As always, remember to spread the awesomeness by sharing it with your friends, families, coworkers, pets, and your breakfast buddies. Until next time, be awesomer.